Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Shomus Banerjee. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the top three reasons for you to choose biotechnology as a career option in 2025 in India. If you have just uh, qualified after plus two and you are looking for biotechnology, you are kind of trying to think whether biotechnology is the right career path for you or not, then this video is just for you. Because this is going to tell you the top three reasons right now could be the best time to get into biotechnology industry and biotechnology career in India. The very first reason is the booming career opportunities in healthcare agriculture industry. Okay, healthcare, agriculture and also other industrial processes that use biotechnology tools to grow themselves and all these places are booming. Now why I say they are booming because <clears throat> in India currently the, the budget, the budget for the sector of biotechnology is sanctioned to be 150 billion dollars 150 billion dollar industry in biopharmaceuticals in healthcare and in agri-tech industries so cumulatively 150 billion dollar industry so obviously it will be growing so there is a chance there will be job opportunities coming in so high demand for the biotechnologies in pharmaceuticals a serum institute biocon are the places where you can go diagnosis so Thermo Fisher Scientific is there, Roche is there, so you can go there. And agri-tech startups like uh, Myco and there are other examples are out there where you can apply and you can get in and start your career. These are very good positions that you can start up with. Next is expanding roles in genomics, stem cell therapy, personalized medicine, bioinformatics and agri and, and, and obviously agricultural side of the plant development as well because biotechnology is not limited to animals only it is applicable to animals as well as plants and there is also artificial intelligence coming in in the biotechnology and who knows what's going to happen after 10 years AI is going to do a lot of works and biotech is a part uh, from the AI that is involved in agricultural technologies industrial technologies and pharmaceutical technologies now the second reason to choose biotechnology as a career option and this is one of my favorite reason is because the government and private sectors are backing up biotech projects and biotechnology research and startups particularly the government of india is backing it so there is dbt uh, department of biotechnology by RAC, biotechnology industry research Assi assistance council is there and also national biopharma mission so these are all the governing bodies that provide a research fundings and also they fund startups with greater value to serve humanity so it is going and India's bioeconomy is rapidly growing uh, and it is attracting also investors not only the the primary investors are most of the cases are DBT or primary cases they are the central government bodies but once they get the seed fundings then the investors start to like the startup and they start to join in and there are multiple startups that come in also Shark Tech India you can see that recently in every single session you will see two three other startups coming in from biotech backgrounds and particularly they are, they are being heavily funded heavily funded by central government of India and government bodies of India and then they might get funding from the Shark Tank or they might get funding outside of Shark Tank. Rising uh, of these biotech startups in uh, synthetic biology, CRISPR gene editing and bioagriculture. Uh, so Bharat Biotech is doing that, String Bio is doing that, C6 Energy is doing that, Bugworks are doing that. So there are many companies out there who are doing this uh, bioagriculture part as well. So agricultural sector in India has to grow because of the huge demand that is out there and the supply is too little. So we need to continue with the supply because in India the population is uh, growing and growing and growing and growing. That is one thing to worry about. But that gives the opportunity to, to, to feed them and bioagriculture comes in. So these companies will definitely grow. The third and another very, very important point, the very important reason to choose biotechnology in 2025 in India is the global demand of biotechnology graduates, particularly from India. Because in India, the biotechnology graduates are not being offered with a good salary. Their career growth is slow. So in that, compared to that, outside of India, they hire Indian people because Indian students are really hardworking and they do a lot of the hard works and and do the, do the work there so biotech professionals are in demand worldwide be it usa be it canada be it europe any part of the europe including uk 
you can get a global job so global job opportunities waiting there and that is what most of the biotech graduates are doing they are not saying in india because in india there is high competition and the salary is low career growth is slow compared to that they are moving out of india and they are getting a better salary better career opportunity but in that case you need to do msc uh, graduation is not enough masters and phd is required either to do msc outside of india or to do msc and phd both or to do only phd or to do post doctoral studies outside india and you can get in there and hybrid careers in biotech plus ai data science and regulatory affairs can also be done can also be considered in here so yeah. if i sum it up uh, right now in 2025 in india uh, if you think uh, to get into the biotechnology career the the good thing about it is that uh, there is a demand compared to the other subjects zoology botany physiology those subjects biotechnology has a much much greater demand in research as well as in industry and you get heavily funding heavily funded research programs by the government of india and also it is being backed by some investors if you run a startup it can be backed by investors and uh, most future proof carriers as you can say because if the ai is going to come but biotechnology is going to stay because it is going to work hand in hand with ai ai is not going to run out of biotechnology they are going to stay along with the biotechnology here in 2025 so we have diverse career options in pharma in agri tech in healthcare and industrial biotechnology so you can choose to get into biotechnology here but if you want to do a decision to take a wise decision right now then you must also watch my video on top three reasons not to select biotechnology in india watch both the videos it will not consume much of your time but you'll get to know about both the side of the coin and once you know that then you can choose which one is better for you so if you like this video, please hit the like button, share this video to friends and colleagues, subscribe to this channel to get more and more videos like that in future. And also let us know uh, what do you think about the biotech career in India in 2025. Thank you. Bye.